started hunting with my dad when I was probably about four, uh, going to the duck blind, he would bring me. Uh, sitting in the deer stand by about the age of nine, eight or nine or so, and then uh, kind of started hunting on my own once I was in my teens. Not to say we live off the land, but we eat and, you know, everything we catch or kill, uh, everything goes in the fridge or the freezer and gets eaten. I'm Brett. This is Little Beaver Taxidermy. I specialize in doing the deer heads and most of the small mammals. Been doing taxidermy for about eight years now. Mason, I work at Little Beaver Taxidermy. I'm part owner over here and taxidermist. Specialize in the birds and fish. We enjoy taking your animal and recreating your memory, turning it into a piece of art that will last forever. I got into taxidermy about eight years ago. Quit playing baseball and was looking for something to do. I've always hunted and fished and loved it. Been pretty blessed to hunt all over the world, basically, with my dad and from caribou to hunting animals in Africa, duck hunting in Canada. We've seen a lot of wildlife from all over the world. Mason was actually working for some guys, and I went over there and watched and helped, and they were like, man mess with this and so I started sewing on a cow elk first time I ever went in a taxidermy shop. So like on after that I was like man this is what I'm doing. I can do this. I like messing with the life size animals. That's the fun stuff. Bringing the whole animal back to life you know not just your traditional shoulder mount bobcats, mountain lion, the bears. Oh, it's a lot more challenging. That is where you do a lot of manufacturing to the, the original form. A lot more work, a lot more sewing, a lot of detail goes into a life-size animal. All the deer we take in, every single one is different. So it's like, I like the animals. I get to see all the animals. I get all the hunting talk, all the fishing talk get to hear all the stories of how these animals are harvested or these fish are caught, these birds are shot. I like living in the story, honestly. That's why we like it, you know, we kind of just get to do what, what we like, really, and that's taxidermy. What's up, man? What's up, man? Yeah, you kick today's ass? Yeah. <laughs>